Electricity is a blessing, energizing our lives every second. With such utter dedication to energy production, NTPC Simhadri Super Thermal Power Station lights our homes, industries, society and aids our endeavors each day. Situated on the outskirts of picturesque east coast of Vishakhapatnam, NTPC Simhadri is one of its kind. Running at a capacity of 2000 megawatts with 4 units, it is the first coastal coal-fired thermal power station of NTPC and also the first that undertakes an extraordinary task of using seawater for condenser cooling and ash disposal, making sure that the emitted waste is processed and recycled, balancing ecology and economics in producing sustainable energy. It also set a track record in greenfield project execution with the first 500 megawatt getting commissioned in a record time of 39 months. The aesthetic appeal to NTPC Simadri is its impeccable infrastructure that consists of India's biggest intake well that draws seawater from the Bay of Bengal. It not only has one of the tallest natural draft cooling towers in Asia of about 165 meters length, but the chimney, towering 275 meters long, demonstrates the magnificent structures driving consistency in maintaining standards and providing efficient and uninterrupted power to the South Indian states of Andhra Pradesh, Kerala, Tamil Nadu, Karnataka, Telangana and Puducherry. NTPC Simadri Rail Fed Coastal Station receives its coal from CIL subsidiaries and Singareni to the tune of 30,000 metric ton per day with 8 to 9 rakes. Since November 2018 till date, station has gone for zero damage with a saving of 4.5 crores on engine hire charges. While upholding flawless planning, operation and maintenance in its core competency, NTPC Simadri prioritizes its social and environmental responsibilities. Partnering with the Green Vishaka project, planting over 12.5 lakh trees in the city and over 6 lakhs in the plant and township, it strengthens its promise to green energy. A socially sensitive and responsible project, the CSR spectacle ranging from education, child development, health and sanitization, Community Training is actively initiating projects like construction of RO plants, Girl Empowerment Mission, Yoga Training to more than 4,000 students that exemplify their extended portfolio, highlighting their contribution in the upliftment of society. With a powerful workforce of 528 employees churning its mission, vision and core values, the power station adorns a glorious history of 17 years jeweled with accolades further giving wings to its future endeavors. From being the first recipient of the prestigious International Project Management Award in 2005, honored with the JICA President's Award for Excellent Rating in Post-Evaluation and the National Award for Excellence in Energy Management by CII and many more that stand as benchmarks of excellence, a persistent motivation to dream bigger and accelerate ambitions as the forward runners in power generation. NTPC Simhadri is having a plan of making thermal itself as a green. Our emissions, we want to bring it down, particularly sulfur dioxide. We are going to install desulfuration plants by 2021-22. The Visayapatnam itself is a fantastic city wherein NTPC Simhadri is a jewel of Visayapatnam. It is near coastal area. It is consuming less water and it is consuming less coal because of its better efficiency. My employees, they are very comfortable. They are going to township and they are relaxing themselves because of the facilities which are there at the township. With a commitment to ensure work-life balance, the premises homes all necessities and facilities for holistic living and supreme quality of life. Bal Bharti Public School, Jeevan Rekha Hospital, Shopping Complex, Sagarika Recreational Club, Tarangam Executives Club, Sakuntalam and Sangamam Auditorium Samyukt Function Hall, Samudrika and Sarada Guest House. NTPC Simhadri is set in its foundation of NTPC core values 
and operates with an underlining safety culture generating clean and efficient energy to stand as a leading icon in the energy sector for years to come.